that's actually is quite now mess because we are in the end of the season and uh, usually it's better you know but now we are really in the end I, we just um, have yesterday the show of the CNC which was um, quite a lot of work but nice I, I'm quite happy and now we are almost uh, a week far from uh, Paris Costa National show so we are in the last you know pieces um, so we are working the real couture piece here and most of the collection is produced in the factory which is in uh, near Palo Vicenza which is my factory so everything now is kind of start to be very hot you know because um, uh, yeah we are, we are really a few hours let's say from from the show Music. Now we start the, the line of uh, CNC here, which, uh, which uh, is, is uh, it's quite a lot of work in Milano. And also the, um, the men's is here. You never know, you never can say, you know, whatever I come back or not. It, it will depend. In, in a way, it's, it's more practical because to move there, we move like uh, 45 people for a week. So it's kind of, the organization is quite difficult also to organize and um, it's a lot of work. So this is an uh, old piece and here is more or less is my, you know, book where, where I have on my book and uh, yeah, where, where I, you know, have a lot of inspiration from the book sometimes. So it's where actually I'm, uh, you know, I make the fitting in this place and uh, sometimes I saw with the guys, you know, the pieces, we, we have quite a lot of space so we put all the fabric on the floor. Um, it's, it's a space where, where uh, yeah, I use quite a lot and then um, uh, sometimes, you know, it's, uh, it's really a, a place to think about. <laughs> Today, the information, they can come from so many places because, uh, you know, you click in, in, in the net and really, you can have incredible stuff. Um, so I think book, I, I love book because book, they are so, you know, they, they give you the chance to, you know, go more with your vision, with more creativity. Sometimes we, when you have a strong image in, in the video or somewhere else, they influence in different way. Book is always more gentle, I say, in that sense. So I like the approach with the book and, and to start from something like that. But it doesn't work every time like that because uh, sometimes, uh, you know, you see something in the street or sometimes you see a, a girl or a boy that inspire you or maybe some places, some art exhibition. I like to keep my mind really open about that. So I'm not, you know, I say, okay, let's found in the book or let's found there. It's, it's something that, you know, when you're a fashion designer, in a way you develop a, a natural, you know, it's like you're a cooker. You always want to try to found a new, you know, test and the same. So your natural um, attention, let's say, is, is to, you know, be touched from something. And uh, I like to keep this approach, which is, for me, is the best. Sunset people. There is a few towns that I like to go sometime. I, I like very much in Europe, I like Berlin. I think Berlin is a, it's, it's very, very, quite interesting city, let's say, because um, uh, there is this kind of, uh, uh, you know, attitude of, uh, of a young, young, natural young. I think it's the most young city in Europe, in a way. And uh, you feel that, you feel this energy to produce some idea and to make uh, interesting things. So it's a nice city. And then, uh, well, I, I love also to travel. I think for fashion, what is also very interesting, I mean, it's Tokyo. You know, when you go in Tokyo, you, you see so many, uh, you see everything there. So it's very privileged point of view because the Japanese, they really are open for that. They, they have all the brands from the most, micro brands from, from Australia, wherever in the world, and they have uh, incredible vintage. They, they do a lot of research. 
So that is another fashion city. But I like also to travel, you know, in in uh, in place where just you enjoy the nature as well. We start literally, you know, to to have experiments uh, on the, you know, uh, on the piece. For example, we start to put fabric and. Then right away I can see, you know, immediately the reaction and if it's something, you know, is correct or not, maybe let's go somewhere else. That's interesting work because I'm, I'm trying to, I, I want to do for, for Paris some kind of couture but very graphic and really, let's say, uh, modern. I, I don't want to do anything uh, retro or... So I try before to make something more constructive, but in the end I realize that uh, this season I like something kind of uh, graphic and, and more modern in a way. Um, timeless, let's say. So I think this will be the approach of the next season. Here we are moving where really we, we do the thing. We, you know, we, we have a kind of a small atelier where we, you know, we stitching and we cutting and we fix all the stuff. So sometimes, you know, when I have some idea, I, the first things I need to, to, to realize is the fabric, you know, the, really literally uh, to understand, you know, how it's, you know, how it's going, if it's more tough, stiff, whatever. Uh, so I, I usually work a lot first with the fabric. And then when I'm an idea about, you know, where I want to go, I start to drawing the things. And then, of course, from the drawing, we start to produce the stuff. Of course, before that, there is a lot of work. <laughs> here, maybe you can have one impression. This section, for example, here um, is where we really, we have the coordination, you know, and the production of all the idea that we send to the factory. And also, I have my assistant. Not everybody's here at the moment, but we have uh, like uh, 15 people work here with me. They, they take care each one of one, uh, you know, somebody take care about the woman, somebody about the man, and somebody about the product of accessory. I'm an old style designer, it means I'm not an art director, like uh, I'm, I'm, I'm working on the real piece and I'm drawing by myself. So that makes difference of the organization because most of the designer, they have a different approach. They have many designer and they just do the art direction and they just want to say more or less what they want to do. Me, I'm more in a way that I'm more involved in all the process. I started 21 years ago. Actually, in September will come out the book of, uh, of uh, 21st year of Costa Nacional, which is quite interesting. We choose with Carlo, my brother, we, we start together to do 21st year because uh, it's incredible, but it's, uh, it's kind of a uh, joke, but it's a strange number in our story. Here we have the section of accessory here, there is a Massimo that take care about the, you know, the bags and the shoes and all the accessory, which is very important business actually for us and even is very important sales because we have one factory of shoes ourselves and it's more than 35% of the total income. And uh, so we really work a lot. We have five, six people here work, take care about, you know, ties or the accessory parts. Here is uh, the, sh the fabric, they are in Paris because now there is a Premier Vision in Paris. And actually we are, um, you know, we are four people here that they, they are going around to looking for vintage piece or fabric anywhere and reproduce that story. Also, more than 70% of the fabric we design by ourselves, so it's a lot of research and, and uh, quite a lot of work before. I experimented a few years ago a beautiful collection called, um, it was inspired by, by Africa. I make a nice uh, trip to Africa and uh, we work on that, try to see from a different point.